what's up guys trade here back with another video so in this video guys i'm going to show you how you can do smooth shake for your edits so the shake i'm going to show you this is the shake i use for all my edits and i'm just going to show you with you guys how you can do this shake and you can use it also for your edits so as you can see i already added my grips so i'm just going to do some more simple transition so i'll be back when i'm done Disappear just like poof, then she's gone. Addicted, don't know what the fuck I'm on. I can't stop it when I feel it coming on. When we chill, it starts with smoking something strong. Take her down, and then she'll be the surface that I'm coming on. So, once you're done to make your transitions, I'm just going to show you how you can do this shake. So, just tap on your script and go to effects, add effects, then the effect you want, we want to first add tires, so go to distortion warp and scroll all the way down and choose this effect called tires and then turn on mirror and make it crop, take crop to 1 and 50 and then go back add another effect and go to move and transform so the effect we're going to add here is Oscreate, Oscreate, Oscreate effect. Then take the angle to 180. Then take frequency. I'm gonna add a keyframe. So add a keyframe from the beginning and I'll take it to zero. And take it from the beginning and add another keyframe. Take it to two and take it from the end. And go to magnitude, add another keyframe also, take it to zero, take it from here, and add another keyframe, put it to 124, and take it here also. So again, go on and add again Oscreate effect, so add again Oscreate effect, go to, if, uh, go to settings. Then take angle to zero, go to frequency, take it, leave it to two, and then add another keyframe, take it to zero, and take it from the end, add on magnitude, so take it to 124. And take it here, add another keyframe, take it to zero so let's do this like this and as you can see we have this shake but we have to add a swing effect so go to effect go on move and transform go down then add swing effect go to angle one add the keyframe Go to second, add another keyframe, take it to zero. Then stop when you say four, stop there, add a keyframe. Then go back, remove the keyframe I've just added, and also remove this one. And take this keyframe here, and add another keyframe right here. So go to angle two, do the same thing. second angle take it to zero 
and then stop and say for so stop there move, move this keyframe and move this one also so take this one right here and this one over here so as you can see we have this shake and now we need to add a motion blow effect so go to blow and go down then choose motion blow take it up all the way up then go to settings take it to 70 and now you are done just copy effect and pass them to all your clips so as you can see this shake is not hard to do and it's really cool for your edits so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you next time with another video i hope you enjoyed this one and don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't yet so i see you next time guys stay safe bye